You and I decided we were going to take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement, an entanglement, an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement, an entanglement, an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement with August, an entanglement, an entanglement, an entanglement with August. I got into an entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. With August. With August. An entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. With August. 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 Entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. An entanglement. An entanglement. An entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. An entanglement with August. An entanglement. An entanglement. An entanglement with August. This is America. Um, it's social media, boy. I'm telling you. So that was the Entanglement remix by I Marquis, one of many sound bites that have come out of the recent Red Table Talk, hosted by Jada Pinkett Smith um, with her husband Will Smith. And the most recent Red Table Talk is one in particular that was highly anticipated. It was done to address rumors about an affair, and we're going to look at a few standouts from the affair, conversation this morning. Hmm? Entanglement. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like, you ever, like, say, a barbed wire fence when you was young, and you crawl through it, and, like, you close it up? Mm. That, but that you crawl through it, like though. A, you like crawl through it. But you crawl through it. But you close tear up. I goodly get crepe and crab. Apparently. 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 So, one of the first things is, hmm. yeah, separation is not a divorce. Um, Jaden will separate it for a time, only to come back together. So these are lessons from mm -hmm. the Red Table Talk we're going yeah. through. Um, almost all marriages go through a season where the couple feels like giving up on each other. Some end completely. Others, like for Jada and Smith, emerge stronger. I just say emerge. I don't know why we say stronger. Well, that's the... That's the them, them never say so at the table. Um, I was going to say that's the illusion they've given, but it's, I don't think it's fair to say it's an illusion. They did say towards the end, Will did say to her that he told her when he married her that he could love her through anything. And... Um, he apparently is proving that he has or mm. can. She told mm. him he was doing a great job with it. Mm -hmm. um, well, it's so sticky, guys. I mean, yeah. people have her off as a master manipulatress um, and, and say they cringed when they were I watching know, it. I know, but it's difficult, I think. Y you see, that's a couple of minutes. And 30. I think it's difficult to really judge someone in a couple of minutes because while a lot has been said there's a lot that wasn't said correct um the, one of the things they did say is we ride together we die together uh the bad marriage for life part which is their kind of off center yes, kind of humor, humor uh -huh. but i don't know how many people uh -huh. <laughs> people took it for the kind of you know bad marriage for life they were like what me don't know about that ride together die together thing yeah i mean it works for some people i tell you you know my my forever i do and 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 one of the couples i won't say which when when they spoke about um where the point where their marriage got to I, I said to her, and women who are watching now are going to say to themselves, why, why were you still there? Mm -hmm. um, but her perseverance and her commitment, it worked out and for obviously her. obviously his too, because one person can make a marriage. Yeah. So at some point he recognized, I know the story you're talking about, yeah. that he was doing or not doing what he But it took to a have. while. Right. It took but, a while. But she hung around and when she saw that there was buying they worked it through. Yeah. I don't think it's about giving up initially, but if you work at it for a while and you see where you're getting negative right, right. how long do you 
stay yeah. in that indefinite space of yeah. Yeah. You know, because there have been rumors swirling around these two for a long, a long, long time. time. So, so this is it. So maybe at the time when they were separating and people said, oh, they have an open relationship. Maybe it's because they were separated. Right. You never know. Um, but different, the, no no two people are alike. So every marriage is going to be different. Yeah. And I think for them, this is one of the things. Um, maintaining a marriage isn't easy. And mm -hmm. people often use Will and Jade as the benchmark mm -hmm. in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. and, and they might be very well be the benchmark in that they're not perfect. And marriages have I'm you know not. issues. Correct. And so you have to decide, am I going to work this thing out? Correct. I said to, some, I said to someone, you have to look at a, a marriage like family. Like you have family members that really, if you could have gone down to RGD and take them off, <laughs> you'd have to take them off, but a family, and so at the end of the day, you just have to accept it is my blood and I'm just going to have to take whatever comes. So maintaining a marriage isn't easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and that's one of the things we took mm -hmm. from it. Um, she said, I'm bringing myself to the table. Um, and so the red table is a place where, you know, she invites guests and other people. And it's a place where um, truth and reconciliation happens. So when she says, I'm bringing myself to the table. It was interesting that Will joined her at the table because I felt like even in that clip when she said, so I had an entanglement mm. and he said entanglement, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. he kind of, um, and then she said relationship. Mm -hmm. And he said, so, okay. And he said, yeah, okay. Yeah. So I think he kind of, to life, it's, it's, it's vital. Facts. Without it, it doesn't yep. happen. Yep, yep, yep. So communication is important and even <clears throat> here, sitting at the table and, and saying some real things by saying, look, I wanted to feel good. It was a long time. I had never felt that way. Sometimes the harsh mm. things have to be said, you know? Um, so that's number one of the six on this lesson says, any marriage can survive and thrive after a shakeup or near death of love experience if the two work at it together. I believe that. Yeah. I believe that. Yeah. You make always a one and can clap. Um, if there's buying for sure, it can. Healing takes time. Um, Dela just mentioned if you don't have fulfillment as an individual, you can't find fulfillment mm. in marriage. Because if you are thinking about you complete me, you know, okay, we get that you feel like you found your other half, but you kind of have to be complete in yourself before you step yeah. into something. Or, yeah. Um, you, you goodly lose yourself. Yeah. Um, childhood trauma and baggage can mm -hmm. affect marriage as well. Mm -hmm. So healing needs to take place yeah. it, it, within you and um, between each other. Because to me, um, before this red table, Will and Jada would have healed the situation, which is why it would be possible for him to even sit there and, and have her speaking. And as this he is what, and four as he, years old, this issue, they said? Four, four and a half years. The red so with this, her and, this, and right, August, right? right. And, um, and he said, well, he also had his, his issues as well. So clearly they both. But it has to happen. I've seen couples have issues and then they get back together. But that healing never took place. And so it's a constant thorn mm -hmm. in the marriage. And, mm -hmm. it, and it goes on and on and on. So if you don't mm -hmm. shut it down and say, look, this happened. We have to heal it. Move past and it. And move past it. It, it's almost like, you know, in a sense, coming back together because mm -hmm. it, it, it won't it mm -hmm. won't get fixed. You keep bringing it up, you keep bringing it up, you keep bringing it up, it's going to yeah. fall apart. Yeah. Um, this is talking about embracing humor in your marriage. Obviously, you know, they found space to laugh inside of what was going on. Mm -hmm. um, honor your word. Um, this one is interesting. You'll never know how much your spouse loves you and is committed to you until he or she has an opportunity to walk away, but he chooses or she chooses to stay. There's there's a lot of power in that. These two, I mean, there seems to be real love there because to yeah, go man. through this and to stick it out and to ride it out. And many other things. Yeah. And many other things. Yeah. Must have a friendship too. Is, uh, I mean, Will Smith, uh, you know, as I, I, I sent you this morning, has, a, has an approach to marriage, like marriage is forever. I'm committed to it. I'm going to make it work. Um, he said the first marriage wasn't working, but 
the wife kicked him out. Not Will get up and say, I'm going to leave. She said, no, this is not work for me. And now he's in the, and he's making it work. Mm -hmm. and, it, and it requires that. Mm -hmm. Are you going to keep moving from marriage to marriage to marriage to marriage to marriage? So. Serial monogamist. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 All, All right. right. Guys. Cool. Good talk. All right. Up next, Rasta Village in Montego Bay. Stay with us.